Ah, good afternoon. So I'm here with my Springfield Armoury uh, XDM uh, BB pistol, and uh, you can see on the magazine it says it's 16 rounds. So this is a, a replica of the uh, .40 SNW uh, 16 plus one magazine. And uh, what I did, I chrony test it. Now uh, I figured I'd only get about three magazines out of this. So um, in in line with the actual magazine, I actually put 17 BBs in. Yeah, one in the breech and 16 in the mag, obviously. And so I fired 51 shots and uh, I got this result here. I gave 15 second break in between each shot just to let the CO2 recover and it's about 15 degrees centigrade. And you can see actually the peaks are where obviously I changed the actual magazine, okay. Now the interesting thing about this BB is it was very consistent, very consistent. If you look at the actual results from each magazine, uh, it was only 11 FPS after 17 shots. It was another 11 FPS after 34 shots. And it was only the last two shots that dropped off to 298, the final shot, that made it 14 FPS. So that's 14 FPS over 51 shots. That is very consistent for a BB. Also, I also weighed it uh, with 17 BBs and a CO2 in, and it came to 906 grams. Um, the real steel actually weighs 907, so the actual weight is actually almost identical, okay? Uh, I also did a, a bit of like, just to, just ran some BBs through it to see where the aim point was. These were freestanding at uh, six yards. And you can see they were grouping down here. Uh, the actual sight's actually very good. Uh, this was at the last uh, the last few shots of the CO2, so it's was, it was probably dropping off off power anyhow, so it's more likely there's a shot around here. So, yeah, um, it, it is shooting uh, low, there's no doubt about it. I mean, these shots here, yeah, I, I was actually aiming way above the target, uh, probably two or three inches. So, yeah, it is shooting low. Uh, I'll show you a, do a proper shooting test and a tin can shot, but I think the answer to this pistol, which is actually very good, is to actually to probably fit a small laser on the front, yeah, and zero the laser up at 10, 10 meters. I think I was just zero the laser, like with all my other pistols. And uh, by putting all the BBs in the centre of the target at 10 meters, it'll allow, allow you to shoot inside that distance and also outside that distance, probably up to maybe 12, 12 and a half meters, which is where I normally shoot my uh, my tin can pyramid from. So yeah, I'm really impressed with it. The actual. Uh, Three magazines max, yeah, 51 shots really if you put 17. It will take 20, but in the interest of realism, yeah, I put 17 in. So that's 51 shots. I did take it, put another 10 through uh, out of tin can. So, yeah, and there's it, it still a bit more go in it. So you could probably get 60, maybe 65 on, on a warm day. Like 15 degrees a day, which isn't too bad. So, yeah, I'm, uh, I've, it, the blowback is really great. We're not going to do the outdoor video. Uh, with the targets and the tin cans, you better see all that. But yeah, I'm really impressed with it. The build quality is actually fantastic. Yeah, um, the actual uh, consistency is probably one of the best in the BB range I've ever, I've ever used. Um, and uh, yeah, the actual the actual power power wise, yeah, uh, you're talking obviously 1.12, 1 1.12 1 1 uh, foot pounds of energy average. But it's the consistency of the actual delivery you know the, the co2 delivery uh with only like, like 15 at least 15 second interval between between shots so yeah so very impressed definitely a really really nice handling pistol thanks for watching